the age of only three and a half years old, these five young males formed an incredible coalition called the Black Rock Boys. These boys are big tanks, and well known as great buffalo hunters. Together we called them the Black Rockers. Among them, there was a powerful male called Olibor. Olibor was one of the most famous lions in the Mara, leading the powerful Black Rock Coalition in the Kenya's Masai Mara National Reserve. Olibor gained fame for his strength, courage and merciless attitude to attack and kill hyenas. <laughs> They have already taken over Maji Afaisai Pride and now they are also trying to take over the Topi Pride. A fight between the Black Rock Boys and the Salas Boys seems inevitable. But in February, something gone wrong. Black Rock King Olibor went missing. Olibor was one among the five great lions of the Black Rock Coalition. A few months ago, Black Rock male Olibor is not seen anymore. Some sources claim that this legendary lion has passed away about few weeks ago under mysterious circumstances. It is believed that he was killed by the herders. Not the first in Mara to face such fate, even a great lion like Lunkido from Ambasili had the same fate of getting killed by the herders. The update comes after reports circulated that the famous lion was possibly a victim of human-wildlife conflict, allegedly killed by a cattle herder in the reserve. However, according to the Kenyan Wildlife Service, intelligence and investigation teams found either evidence nor information was gathered to prove the allegations. The Kenya Wildlife Service has addressed allegations that Olibor, a lion that belongs to the Black Rock Pride was killed in Masai Mara Reserve by pastoralists. According to Kenya Wildlife Service, intelligence and investigation teams responded to the reports by visiting the scene, but no evidence was recovered to support the allegations. The foundation tasked the top management of the reserve together with Mara Predators, a research team whose work is monitoring lions to look for Olibor, the authority said in a statement on Monday evening. They assured the public that they would provide an accurate account of Olibor when the facts had been established. Unconfirmed reports had indicated that Olibor was killed in the Mara, and there has been inaction from the Kenya Wildlife Service and other authorities. This culminated in a petition on Change.org, calling on people to boycott Kenya's tourism over the murder of the Black Rock Pride member. The petitioners claimed Kenya Wildlife Service do nothing when lions are killed by illegal grazers in the Mara. Each lion, each leopard, each cheetah plays a pivotal role in maintaining the delicate balance of our ecosystem. Their disappearance isn't just a tragedy, it's an imbalance that ripples through the savanna. These big cats don't just vanish, they are pushed out of existence by human actions that remain unseen, unspoken, and unaddressed. <laughs> One of Masai Mara's most iconic lions, Olibor and the five-member Black Rock Lion Pride are a famed attraction of the Kenyan Game Reserve. There are an estimated 2,589 lions in Kenya, according to the Kenyan Ministry of Tourism. It's time to bring this to light. It's time for stringent policies from the government. It's time to address the issue of cattle grazing within these sacred reserves, which tempts fate and leads to fatal encounters between livestock and predator. These five black rockers definitely formed a very promising coalition to be followed and observed for the next few years, comparable to another big coalition, the five Nkuyenai boys. But the tragic demise of Olibor is a great loss for the coalition. His awe-inspiring spirit and undisputed leadership left an indelible mark on the lands of the Maasai Mara. His tragic departure at the hands of cattle herders is a painful reminder of the urgent need to protect and preserve wildlife. May his nobility inspire all to strive for a future in which lions and his kingdom can live in harmony with those that coexist in their natural habitat.
Mara reserve without King Olibor is very calm and quiet. Olibor was the chaos always chasing intruders, fighting rival males or fighting his own brothers, his favorite hobby was killing hyena. Olibor deserved to die in battle like the warrior he was, not at the hands of humans what a shame. Rest in peace, brave Olibor, there was only one animal capable of defeating you, the man. Your legacy will live on in our hearts. Thank you.